Cheers, everyone. Welcome back to another bespoke beer review for the Beer Connoisseur. And in this one, we are going to Germany. The cat is playing up. We're going to Germany and we have got a black lager. And it uh, confesses to be Germany's number one black lager beer. And we're off to Kostritzer. And we have a bottle of Schwarz beer. Super smashing great. Coming in at 4.8% ABV, there's a back side. I've just brought up a little bit of information. It says Constrictor Schwarz beer is brewed at Germany's famous Constrictor Brewery, which was established in 1543. One of the most notable drinkers of Constrictor Schwarz beer was Johann Wolfgang van Gogh, who sustained himself on black beer from Constrictor when he was unable to eat during periods of illness i absolutely um apologize for my pronunciation of stuff there but never mind it's the way it goes so let's crack this open like you do oh a little bit of smoke there yeah see what we get mm, a little bit of dark fruit aroma coming through kind of like dark plum maybe but like Tin prunes, maybe that type of thing. There's a slight hint of roastedness there behind it. It's quite malty. Yeah, it smells nice. Now, my good mate Stefan in Germany has, has handed me this thing called a Taste Hero. I haven't got a clue what it does, but you're supposed to put this on top of your your bottle, and it's supposed to do something to it apparently. So I'm gonna do it. So I'll put it on top of the bottle, as it says. So you pour it out in this glass and it's supposed to I don't know what it's supposed to do <laughs> well, I'll tell you what it is supposed to be doing it's giving it a big bloody head anyway <laughs> anyway it's a, a taste hero um, he, he sent me the pack but he didn't uh, tell me uh, any other info on it it's probably you stick it on the end of your, your bottle and it's supposed to I don't know, do something with the carbonation, I'm not too sure. Or, or, you know. But never mind, I'm most probably doing it wrong. As ever. As ever. I'm going to pause it for a minute. Back again, back again. It's, I'll just settle down, as you can see. I'll take this off so you can have a better look at it. Um, there you go, it fits on the end of your, your, your bottle. And apparently, when you pour it through, it does it, it it does something to the carbonation of the beer. I'm not too sure uh, whether or not you get more taste. Well, it's called a taste hero, so I don't know. Anyway, being a class, I'll try my next one as well. As you can see, beautiful looking head. Look at that. Maybe that's the taste hero. What's done that? Look at that. Kind of foamy, big spacious bubbles in that. It looks a, a head to die for. I tell you what. If that's the tasty way of doing its job, it's done a good job. Um, jet black. And again, not much. Maybe a little bit of roastedness there. I'm going to go in, you know, so cheers, everyone. Hmm. Subtleness of roasted malts there, straight away. Lovely drinkability to this beer. Start so hitting the smokeness there. Not much, but you can just pick it up. As I keep drinking it, it's going down a tree. It is very drinkable stuff. I'll say, start hitting the roastedness, a little bit of smokeness. <laughs> the cat's kicking off. Excuse me. Right, let's do this one together. Come on. God, he's in one. Smell that. What do you reckon? Do you like it? Mm, lovely little roastness to it, as I keep saying. Like a slight smokeness with a bit of licorice maybe in it. Um, it's really nice, you know. It's going down a treat. It, I'll get, be quite happy supping this for a very, very long time, like you do. <laughs> One more for the road, because this cat's playing up. 
Mm, cracking stuff. It is. There's a slight sweet edge on the back end I've just picked up as well. Carrying it all through and that. Kostritzer Schwartz beer. Highly recommend that one, boys and girls. Pick one up, give it a go, tell me what you think. Hammer me in the comments about my pronunciations. As ever, see all of you on another one. Cheers.